we're back. The time is now 626. Just so you know, break times are pick on Victoria times around here. So That's right. yeah, let's hardly. get to it. Be honest. <laughs> Jeff, be honest. what do you have with you today? Well, can I first say that I really put it all out for you guys here, and I had a rough morning just for you. Oh, I was supposed to, I wanted to bring some goats. I had a whole different <laughs> segment plan. They did not cooperate. It was a rough morning. I about broke my nose hitting the glass oh, no. on the van. It was rough. Oh, no. But the good news is I decided on a different animal, this beauty right here, <laughs> the vault. We'll and to make my it. morning even better, he threw up on the way oh, here, right. making my van smell really good. So Ooh. I am so glad to be here so <laughs> early in the morning. I can only imagine what you guys feed him there at yeah, the zoo. It, it is gross. Now, in all honesty, what a cool animal this is. And you guys have met him before, yes. but I wanted to bring him for timing because spring's coming. The okay. warm temperatures, it's getting us thinking about warm temperatures, and that means the vultures are going to be coming back. They are migratory. They come back from South America, and we'll oh. start seeing them in buildings probably in another month or two. So. Wow. The vultures we see around Billings are all the way from South America. Yeah, a lot of them are, uh, or wow. southern, or the southern U.S. But a lot of okay. them do come from South America and actually migrate all the way up here. And we love to have them around because they're nature's garbage, man. They take care of all that nasty <laughs> stuff out there that we want nothing to do with. They're roadkill. Yeah. That's yeah. Russell's favorite That's part. That's what I said. I told Victoria, I was like, man, the vulture has been doing their part yeah. to clean up America's roadkill for a lot of it's years. It's so true, <laughs> and they really have. And that's why they're so good to have around. They're like these little trash collectors that take mm -hmm. care of bacteria and disease and everything else. But they're well built for it. That bald head uh -huh. keeps them clean. So when they stick their head down inside a carcass, they don't have to worry about getting blood and guts gooped up in their feathers. So that's yeah. a good thing. They don't have to, it'd be like getting bubble gum stuck in your hair. It'd be gross. And you also see how he's got that see through nostril. Look how you can see that's right through that. That's my favorite part. Do you know yeah. what that's for? It's yeah. gross. It's to push blood out. So when he's gorging on food, wow, he can perfect. breathe a little bit easier as blood's getting gorged Delicious. up in his nose pretty awesome yes. so I mean these guys are well built for what they do and gosh they are great to have around and beautiful to see fly I don't know if yeah. you've ever seen a fly oh, yeah. this is a great topic for the breakfast crowd out there right now <laughs> <laughs> pushing blood through your nostrils down perfect down cereal spoon there and there's now. yeah and there's more gross stuff talking about them throwing up they really they do that for a reason it's either they're upset or I rushed them this morning which is probably why oh, he did okay. that but what they do is they do that uh, because it stinks so bad because they eat rotten food imagine it smells bad going down imagine eh, when it smells like coming back Back up, and mm -hmm. so not many animals want to stick around with the smell that bad, so it keeps I'm, their predators away. I, for one, am happy he threw up in your van. Yeah, and not, <laughs> not here, not here, here because no. it, it would be every it, it stinks. I gagged; it was so bad. It, it takes a lot for me to gag nowadays with the, being in the zoo business for so long. So <laughs> it was not a pleasant experience. But yeah, speaking of those feet, we're going to talk about the, the next segment and why okay. they're white. I'll let your imagination run wild. I have so many questions. Thank you, you, you so betcha. much. <laughs> <laughs> well, Lurch doesn't necessarily like me, so that was my reaction. Look at that wingspan. <laughs> my palms are sweaty right now. That was like instant sweat. I, we'll be back I after this break. With you. <sighs> Breathe 